Leviticus 19, verse 28, was more of a chill suggestion, making tattoos completely acceptable for Christians today. Mm, acceptable is going to be doing a lot of work here. So Leviticus 19.28 says, yeah. no tattoos. Well, yeah. Now I can't help but notice. Got a little, got a little ink there on that. That's just, that's henna. That's fake. I, do that. <laughs> I redo that every morning before I come out. Such yeah. a pose. Nice henna that's, Cairo, that's, yeah. The permanent the, marker. Just, yeah, the, the Hindu artist, or more likely some like lib woman artist doing henna tattoos, she must be very confused every morning when you say, I need the Cairo on my arm. Yeah, well, and see, the again, the question is not framed exactly correctly because my, well, I don't want to give my answer until you've guessed. Okay. So the, so the question, the question acceptable is, the, is it, are we talking about chill, the, chill suggestion? Yeah. As is far, it unfair framing yeah. to begin with? Yeah. As far as I know, God, particularly in the Old Testament, does not generally make chill suggestions. Right. Neither chill nor suggestion yeah. would apply <laughs> yes. to the Old Testament at any point. Yeah. So. But the question is today, do, th do those specific laws still hold today? Uh, right. And I, I'm confident that you would say no, that they don't hold. Yes, I suppose. Okay. Now, uh, yes, on the, on the, I think the substantive read of the question well, is I, true. Yes. However, I, the, the word acceptable. Right. It is, it is my opinion that the only people who should have tattoos are convicts and sailors. Now, Do not body shame me, first of all. <laughs> How dare you? I, know. It's, you, I will say, you've got a kind of burly demeanor. You, yeah. you can pull, and it's a, it's a strange tattoo because it's, it's an ancient Christian symbol. Like it's, that, oh, is that what it is? I don't know if you know. Yeah, uh, I thought it was Japanese for water. I was wow, going for yeah, I was going I for don't... RX like prescription, and I, yeah. I forgot to. The... <laughs> Maybe you got to go back. I'm just in. a big fan of uh, no. Tylenol. Yeah. Uh, yes. Okay. So we both got that right. So yeah. I guess we should drink. Are those the rules? By the way, I know I totally respect um, the view of uh, hating tattoos. Yeah. And I should be a guy who hates them, so it's very confusing for people. Yes. Like, um, but. In terms of the uh, the Old Testament argument, I, I find it absurd. Clearly, yeah. those are not uh, those are ceremonial Jewish laws that don't. And there is a difference between moral laws, ceremonial right. laws. This right. This is sometimes people get tripped up on this, but there are. And especially tattoos in that context would have been pagan symbolism. Yeah. Right. But also, if you get the little like the Japanese for water, you know, like the twenty year old white girls do, that that is immoral. That is a damnable yeah. offense. I will agree with you there. Yes, okay.